Good evening, DeFi family. Bruce here with another video. I'm just a regular guy documenting my DeFi life. And in that process, I hope that my documentation will somehow help you guys too. Whether I fail or succeed, whatever the outcome, I hope that uh, we can have some wins together. So on that note, tonight I want to talk about Drip Network. Now the animal farm currently is paused. Everything is paused on the farms. And that's going to be paused for probably nearly two weeks, according to the developer Forex Shark. Drip Garden is still pumping along, still printing. So don't forget to get involved with the Drip Garden if you aren't already. There's some good gains to be made there. But tonight, I want to focus on Drip Network. Drip Network for me, I've been involved for a couple of months now. I always do a spreadsheet with some kind of strategy or calculation to formulate a plan or strategy. Now, in crypto or in DeFi, if you don't have a plan or a strategy, you may as well be at the casino, throwing your money on the table, as far as I'm concerned. Now, I always have a plan, I always have a strategy, but to do that, I need to work out the figures and the numbers and the calculations and all that sort of stuff. So I created a drip calculator or a strategy for a drip network. Uh, I did it over 12 months because drip is a long term project and it's already been uh, running for 12 months. So I thought I'd do my strategy for 12 months. I did this calculator when I first invested in drip just to figure out what was the best plan for 12 months. And uh, like uh, any of my calculators or any strategies that I do, all the links are in the description. Uh, other links to other uh, projects or strategies will be in the link above right now. So get a load of those. Um, yeah, so my calculator, I did, I did a 12 month calculator and this is basically, it's almost a choose your own adventure for drip. You can really pick your own compounding strategy, your own withdrawal strategy. Uh, it's, to, it's totally up to you. So with that note, let's have a quick look. So my current drip balance is 12.5 drip, close enough, 12.527 deposits. So I put 12.5 uh, drip in the, the current balance. The daily interest is 1%. Withdraw drip compound monthly. Compound every one drip or withdraw every one drip. So what happens there is uh, my months are spread out from left to right. Month one, two, th right through the 12th month. Okay. So... What happens is if you pick withdraw every one drip or compound every one drip, the spreadsheet will highlight every time your compound or your, uh, sorry, your, your available drip to compound or, or claim, it will highlight it. So every time it hits one, it's highlighted there, one, 1.08, 1.02. So what you can do is every time that hits one is you can choose to claim or you can choose to compound. So if you leave that unselected, it will automatically compound it back into your deposits. If you select withdraw, it will withdraw. As you've seen at the, at this, the first month, uh, I have choose, chosen to withdraw one drip, which is listed here, and then compound two drip. And over here is the information, compound drip 2.08, withdraw drip one, one, one drip. And the value is $48. And I've also put the value in Indonesian rupiah because that's where I currently live. So I've put the, trend, uh, the exchange there for uh, changing to Indonesian rupiah. So basically that's really that simple. Underneath here we have the initial investment. So if you put in a certain amount of drip, it'll tell you how much that currently, the current value of that drip is. And it'll tell you also in rupiah, which is... Indonesian rupiah and then the 12 month ROI so we have 12 months listed here so with my current strategy what I've chosen to do with my current strategy is the first three months I'm just going to compound everything compound for the first three months there's no withdrawals at all and currently with the price being at $54 as we see here 
54.66. That's the BNB drip price. Uh, yeah, there was no point in, in withdrawing at that at that price, even though I got in at a little bit cheaper price originally. That's still too cheap. So the plan is three months compound until the fourth month. And in this 12 month ROI, you'll see it listed here. Okay, just had a quick fix on a price bug there, but you can see here in the first three months, I have no income coming in at all, three months of compounding for the full three months, no withdrawals at all. And then the fourth month, as we scroll over here, the fourth month I've decided to take three, uh, three withdrawals. And it's important to note that uh, in order to grow your drip, in order to grow your drip deposits, never withdraw more than you compound. So, in the fourth month, I've got 5.9 compounded drip and 3.89 withdrawn drip, and <clears throat> it'll start to chip away at your investment, your initial investment, and then it'll show after the next three months, month four, five, and six, your initial investment is paid off by withdrawing. Only enough to get to get a return on your investment and not too much to reduce your compound. So always compound more than we, you withdraw. And then the strategy is to every month after that, seventh month, eighth month, ninth month, always withdraw just enough to keep compounding your actual deposits, to keep growing your deposits. So the seventh month, eighth month, I've, so, that, for example, the eighth month, I've got 11.42 drip compound and 7.3 drip withdrawn, which is $359, and so on and so forth. And by the 12th month, it'll get to a point where you've actually got over 100 drip in your deposits, which will give you one drip, more than one drip a day. And again, staying with that strategy of, of not taking out too much and just compounding as much as possible. So the 12th month... I've compounded 30 drip and I've, I've withdrawn 12 and made a, a small profit of $589 for that month. Now this is a long-term strategy and it's important to try not to get greedy with these, these things. These, these kind of DeFi projects, they're a slow burn. You have to compound and compound and, and try not to withdraw as much as possible. And uh, don't get too greedy. Like I said, don't get too greedy. Just be patient and work at it underneath this little table here we've got the outcome so the profit for the end of the 12 months with two two thousand eight hundred and eighty dollars from an initial events but from an initial investment of six hundred and seventy five dollars and and the finishing drip count will be 151 drip when you started with 12.5 your drip value drip faucet value will be eight thousand one hundred and sixty nine and your daily income would be 1.5 drip, which is $81 per day. So to me, that's a, that's a really amazing project. I mean, if I put if I put eight, $675 into a bank today and 12 months time, I'd have maybe a 0.01% return on my, on, on my uh, investment or my deposit. And this is giving you 1% a day. So Sure, every, every few days you have to get in there and, and uh, rehydrate your drip. But honestly, this is uh, nothing. It's nothing really. So that's my strategy. That's my personal strategy. This is not financial advice. You can download this strategy in the link in the description. And you can do whatever you want with it. You can put in your balance, whatever balance you want. Whether you have 40 drip, you can take out every two drip or compound every two drip. So what you have to do is update the information to whatever suits your current balance and from there you can pick your own strategy and take out as much as you want you can compound as much as you want it's totally up to you all right guys that's my drip 12 month strategy compound for the first three months and then after that just do a balance of withdrawal and compounding, making sure your compounding is always above the amount that you withdraw. So you're growing your bags every month while still maintaining uh, a little bit of income as well. Of course, this is not your, this is not my only project and it shouldn't be your only project. You should diversify your projects. So, I mean, 
the income from this per month for me is not going to be the only thing I'm actually earning from DeFi. So it will accumulate along with my other passive income plays, which will be a nice bag once they all start flourishing. So, well, I hope you're all safe and well and uh, stay strong in this market at the moment. Keep patient. It'll turn around eventually. Now, again, the links are on the description. Don't forget to like this video, smash the notification button and hit the subscribe button. Cheers, guys. See you in the next one. Bye.